And your girl did a thing this morning. Hey guys. Hey guys, that sounded crazy. Sorry, it's dark. I'm just getting home and um, kind of, oh sorry, it's dark guys. Sorry. There we go. There's Heidi. I'm um, just getting home and I'm sneezing like crazy. Oh my gosh. I don't know what happened. My sinuses were um, kind of crazy today and uh, all of a sudden I just started sneezing right before I turned the camera on. But anyway, I just want to say hey, happy Friday. And y'all, look at my hair. Like I think this is possibly the very best twist out I have ever had. Um, look at that. Look at that like super awesome definition like and this is end of day so this has been I took it out what five in the morning and it's almost six in the evening now so it's been over 12 hours and it still looks I think I think it's, it looks pretty good um so yeah not like bragging or anything but I've never had this good of a twist out which is why I don't really like twist outs but there it's a nice way um to um tame or can have more control of my hair especially when I'm at work because when I just have my regular curls I think it's a lot bigger but twist out kind of gives it a little more tame look um anyway so um I'm really excited and I'm really excited because I use really simple products and I just in the hotel last night so it wasn't like I was home with like all my stuff I'm going to show you guys what I used I used um this uh Shea uh, Moisture Curl Hands and Smoothie I use this which I use all the, all the time and I didn't have any gel I didn't have anything. I also put water in my hair. And I didn't wash it. I just wet, wet, like, I sectioned off in threes and wet each section. So it was wet, but not, like, washed wet, you know? Um, and then this is, oh, Kennedy snatched a label off of this. I'm going to tell you what this is. I use this. Any of my, uh, 1980s babies know what this is? This is some good old-fashioned blue magic hair grease. Um... And I guess grew the grease and the water. It held it as if I have like gel or something on it. So between this Blue Magic hair grease and um, this uh, Shea Moisture Curly Hanson Smoothie, it produced this. So we'll see how it keeps. But I must say, I am really happy with the results of this twist out. So we'll see. Um, the next time I do it, I'm going to use the same products and hopefully it'll do, give me the same results. And then I'll know it was just, it's the products and not just the fluke accident of um, twisting. Because I did, I twist, twist it, it, sorry, lights out, I'm leaving the bathroom. Um, I twisted it with the same amount of twists that I normally do. So it wasn't, it wasn't anything more, you know, it wasn't like I made smaller twists or anything like that. I did the same amount. And it came out like this, so I'm happy. Um, anyway, I'm gonna try to do my workout before Damien and Kennedy. Um, Kennedy, sorry, Damien was telling me that he was at my mom's getting Kennedy. Before Damien and Kennedy gets in, I'm gonna try to get my workout in. That way, when they get home, we can just relax because I have my clothes in the wash. And I may try to go to the grocery store tonight. I don't know. I may, I may try to go early in the morning because I have to go to work tomorrow. So it's just one day home, one night home, one break. But um, it's all worth it in the end because I have vacation coming up. So I'll be off for a while. Anyway, let me get this workout in because they'll be home in probably like another hour if he's just getting Kennedy. So, yeah. Look who it is, guys. Say hi, everybody. You want to say hi to everybody? No, Kenny, come back. Where's Kenny? Where's Kenny? There she is. Come over here. Come over here. Come say hi to everybody. No. No, you don't want to? Come here. You want me to be a doggy? No, you have no, no, I don't want you to fall on your socks, baby, okay? Be careful, don't run. She wants me to run after her like a doggy and chase her, but I don't want her to run off with those socks. You want to get in mama's? You want to get in with mama? Yes. Yes, are you getting in with mama? Mommy's going to buy you a robe for your birthday. If I can find one for you. Okay, so you can have your own. And people, I'm not just like walking in a robe because I'm always taking a bath. Or maybe you may think I'm super clean. But sometimes when I get cold in the house, I put my robe on because it's cold. And I don't want to put the heat on. 
and I just put my robe on and I'm okay because I want to wear a sweater all day. What are you doing down there, huh? What are you doing down there? Nothing, mommy. Nothing. Mama missed you. Mama missed you. I miss you, boogers. What are you doing in Mama's room? <gasps> what are you doing? Huh? Huh? What are you doing? What you doing, girl? Anyway, um, Damien came home and Kennedy came home. They came home together because he picked her up. And um, Kennedy and I are just chilling at home because Damien went back up to get, I decided I want some Chipotle for dinner, so he decided, he went to Chipotle and he has to, he went to go get some things from the grocery store for me, so I need for um, work for tomorrow. So he went up to Chipotle and the grocery store, and um, so we're home. What are you doing? You, you're all tied up in mama's robe, baby. Kenny, slow down, you're twisting me up. Hey, hey, you're gonna run into something. Come on. So yeah, so my mom, my mom redid Kennedy's hair. Kennedy, let's show everybody your hair. Mm -hmm. Come here. Let everyone see your hair. It's pretty. Slow down. Turn around really slow. Cool. Good. <laughs> That's so pretty. So yeah, I just need to um, put some stuff on her ends and make her hair curl back up. Well, it's curl. It's like it's fluffy now, so. Put something on it and start doing the four she made into three and I think that's pretty cute. So that'll last for the weekend until I come home and Damien won't have to do it. Which you probably won't be watching this until Monday. So it would have last, it lasted the weekend. And uh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because I'm going to post this on Monday. Even though it's Friday, but it'll go up on Monday. Anyhow, um, let me get my bags packed for tomorrow. Fun. Welcome to the morning, good people. It's breakfast time. We're having a little family breakfast before I have to leave out for work. And your girl did a thing this morning. Did me get that plate from her? Anyway, um, I made some, we got some cheese grits, and some turkey sausage, and eggs, and some pecan pancakes. And Dad Kennedy's eating. Damien is eating. Is it delicious? But we, we all know that I am the better cook of the family. We know this. <clears throat> What's the difference between your grits and mine? Because uh, he added extra cheese. Because as he's added to have enough cheese. Mommy, juice. Juice, drink your milk. That just said. looks like regular grits. That's not cheese grits. Juice, juice, mommy. Whatever. Juice. You said you wanted milk. Drink the milk. <laughs> okay, we'll get you some juice. Let me get her some juice. She wants juice, not milk. Hello, hello, people. Let's open some light up in here. I'm at work and um, I'm in wonderful Oklahoma City. Here's my outside view. I think I've been here before with you guys. It's not, nothing really over there. Just buildings over here. I don't know what that is. There's the, can I see the arena from my view? Let's see something there's something like the ice hockey ring over there or something it's right out to that like right over there or something but the um where the let the light adjust back right where the um the basketball team plays is not too far oh from me and um anyway i'm sitting in my room i'm on a pm trip which means Nothing starts until like late in the evening. I work all the nighttime flights, which I don't really like that because I'm not a PM kind of person. Anyway, uh, working at night. Anyhow, I just saw uh, my flights are canceled for today. I was supposed to go from Oklahoma City to Chicago to Philly. And if you live in the Northeast, you know that the snow and ice is coming. And so they um, canceled my flights. They haven't given me anything else yet. So. I don't know what I'm gonna do as of yet, but I'm sure something's going to go on, but it's still really early. I wasn't even supposed to even get on those flights or leave the hotel until 5.45 this evening, and it's, I don't know, like a quarter till noon right now, so it's all the time, it's the time. But um, 
I don't know. What am I going to do? I need to go work out. I really don't feel like it, but I need to because I had like a really huge breakfast downstairs, but I just don't feel like working out. So, so I don't know. I'm still here in the same spot. Not really. I did move. Sorry, guys. That sun is like crazy. Excuse me. I'm getting ready to eat some lunch, my salad. On the chicken and chia, which it's actually more like dinner time because it's 5:30 in the evening. But I worked out at around two, and I worked out for like an hour and a half, which was awesome. Um, so I had a really good workout. I did like an hour on the treadmill, then like 30 minutes on the elliptical. So that was good. I got that done, um, and I came back and kind of took a nap a little bit, and then I just got up and showered. And so I have to get ready because I was originally going to leave at 5:45. Now I'm leaving at seven. And I am not going to Chicago because it's cold and icy and snowing, so I can't go that way. So I'm supposed to go to Houston and uh, just spend the night in Houston. So I'm just going to deadhead to Houston. So I'm just going to catch a ride, not even working, um, and hopefully catch up with the rest of my trip for tomorrow. But um, nonetheless, I just want to let you guys know that I worked out today. And that was fun. Um, so I did my workout, and I'm going to eat now. Um, I had a really big breakfast this morning, and... I just wasn't hungry. I'm just starting to get hungry right now, even after working out. After I worked out, I did eat a banana and some peanuts, but um, I wasn't like super hungry. I just wanted a little snack. Anyway, I'm going to eat this and then um, finish getting ready. So, yeah, we'll see what the uh, events for tonight have in store for me. Fun times. All right, good people. I am, um, as you can see, dressed for bed. Um, I ended up going out to Houston. I don't know if I told you guys that, but um, and I'm dead heading to Houston, so I'm in Houston now, and I am going to take myself to sleep because it's about 9.53, which means it's 10.53 um, East Coast time, so my body feels like it's almost 11 o'clock at night. So I'm going to um, head off to bed, and I will talk with you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.